on this best strip of gorgeous white sand and a stunning view lies Lido Beach, a symbol of hope for a nation rebuilding after decades long conflict. And on the sandy shores of Mogadishu, we meet with 45 year old Oud Maestro Awis Kabanle. The Oud strapped across his back is everything he owns. Awais is an entertainer at this seafront restaurant, playing traditional music to beach a revelers every weekend. His songs offers a fresh perspective of a rediscovered Somalia. His music performed in a classical manner that stretches back into the ages. Revelers stay out at Lido Beach past dusk to have a glimpse of the beautiful night skyline, the deep blue ocean and also enjoy the fresh breeze from the Indian Ocean. The public loves the old music and that's what makes us perform at such venues. The songs we play here are played in a language they understand. I entertain them with love songs as well as patriotic ones depending on their taste and preference. A way skills of entertainment also offers the young a chance to learn how music was played in the past and a chance to reconnect with the culture of traditional music. I am a big fan of all music. It's my favorite type because it's very rich in history. I also love coming to Lido Beach, here to join my friends in listening to songs that were played during the good old days. Some of my audiences are young people who are learning their language and appreciate it when they see a musician playing the song as it was played in the past. The current musicians play songs in a modernized way, but people tend to like my style and order any song they want. Somalia boasts of a rich culture in arts, poetry and music. It's mostly referred to as nation of poets and always wants this beautiful culture preserved and nurtured. Awais says as music can play an important role in peace building. Some of his songs date back to the early 80s, when Somalia had one of the strongest and most powerful governments in the African continent. And as Somalia slowly rebuilds after decades long conflict, Awais hopes to use his music as a source of inspiration of a better future for Somalia. Most of the musicians fled Somalia and are now living abroad. I appeal to them to return back and help rebuild the music industry and at the same time offer guidance to upcoming musicians who will maintain the traditional Somali music. And as stability slowly returns to Somalia, the country's young people here say that they hope to take a leading role in the realization of a more modern, unstable Somalia. <laughs> Abdul Aziz Bilon, CGTN, Lido Beach, Mogadishu, Somalia.